Okay, so this is my first example for our topic, area between two curves. It says, find the area bounded by y equal to 3x and y is equal to x squared. So the graph of these two functions are a straight line for this function and a parabola opens upward, okay? Yung sa ating second equation. Ang una muna natin gagawin, uh, by the way, I'm going to solve this uh, problem in two ways gamit yung vertical strip or vertical element at gamit yung horizontal strip or horizontal element okay for solution number one gagamitin ko yung vertical strip okay solution number one okay so unan muna natin kunin yung points of intersection or point of intersection nitong uh, dalawang functions na to. Tingnan natin kung ilan yung points of intersection. Solving the points of a point or points of intersection. Okay. Then, paano yun? We have um, y equals y. Okay? Substitution na lang tayo. We're going to solve the two equations simultaneously. We have y of the first y equal to the second y. Okay? So we have 3x here and x squared here. Now, transpose natin si 3x. So we have x squared minus 3x. And then, factor natin si x. So we have x quantity x minus 3. Okay? This is equal to 0. So we have x equal 0. And x equal to 3. Okay? If x is equal to 0, so if x, if x equal to 0, ano kayong value ni y? Okay? So, gamitin natin yung equation ng straight line. So, we have y, 3 times 0, therefore, y is also 0. So, a one point of intersection is, is at uh, 0, 0. Okay? Another, if x equals to 3, if x equals to 3, determine natin si value ng y. Gamit ulit itong equation na to, we have y equal to 3 times 3. It's 9. So, the second point of intersection is 3, 9. Okay? Ten. So, dalawa. So, i-graph natin yung ating dalawang functions. Okay? We have here 1, 2, 3. Okay? 1, 2, 3, 5, 6. Let's say ito yung 3, 9. Okay? Ito yung 0, 0. So, ibig sabihin na andito yung ating straight line. Okay. Ito yung straight line natin. Now, yung ating parabola, this is a parabola, opens upward and vertex at the origin. So, tatama rin siya sa 3, 9 and 0, 0. So, paganito siya. Okay. Paganon. Okay. Now, ito yung ating y equal to 3x, by the way, ito yung y, 0, x, okay, so ito si y equals 3x, ito naman si y equals x squared, okay, so ito yung ating 3, 9, ito yung ating 0, 0, ito yung dalawang points of intersection. Now, yung solution number one natin, para makuha natin yung area bounded by these two functions, gagawa tayo ng vertical element. Okay, ito yung ating vertical element. So, ito yun. Yeah. So, ito yung ating dx. yung ating 
y upper minus y lower. Okay. So, ano ba yung y upper natin? Ang y upper natin, yung ating top ng ating vertical element ay tumama dun sa ating sa functions na 3x. Sa makatwid, ang upper natin is y equals 3x. At ang lower natin ay yung y equals x squared. Okay? Ito yung upper curve. Ito yung upper function, lower function. Okay? So, gamit yung ating formula. Formula natin ay area equal to y upper minus y lower times dx from a to b. Okay? Now, since ang ating variable of integration is x, therefore, ang gagamitin nating lower and upper limits ay yung interval of x from 0 to 3. Okay? Now, ano yung y upper natin? Ito. Ito yung upper. Ito yung lower. Again, bakit ulit siya tinawag na upper? Kasi yung ating vertical strip, yung top niya, doon tumama sa function na yan. At yung lower part ng ating vertical strip, tumama dun sa ating uh, function na y equals x squared. Kaya ito yung tatawaging upper function, lower function, or upper curve, lower curve. Okay? So, ang upper natin ay ito. So, kundi na ang area. Integral of um, okay, uh, y upper 3x minus y lower x squared dx from 0 to 3. Kasi yung variable integration natin ay x. So, we use interval of x from 0 to 3. Then, integrate natin. We have 3x squared over 2 minus x cubed over 3 from 0 to 3. Okay? So, solve na natin. Continue natin. Equal to, substitute natin yung ating lower and upper limits. We have 3 times 3 squared over 2 minus 3 cubed over 3 minus 0, 0 na to. Okay? Kasi 3 times 0 squared is 0, 0 cubed is 0. So we have area equal to 9 times 3 is 27, so 27 over 2. Minus 27 over 3. Okay? So, we have 3 times 27 is 60, 81. 81 minus 54 over 6. Here equal to what? Dito muna. That is equal to 27 over 6. Simplify natin. Divide both by 3. We have 9 over 2 square units. So, yun ang ating answer para sa, sa ating example. Number one, gamit yung ating first solution which is the vertical strip. Okay? So, that is our answer for example number one. So, watch the next video para naman sa solution number two using the same problem. Thank you.